Man, I love me some retro mode. You type slash retro mode to turn this on, type it again to turn it off. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Siphon. We are back again for another Pro Trip to Dove. Yeah, yeah! Squish him! Squish him all! Diagolo! Yes, I need to give him and Brandex a little bit of a shout out on the side. Oh my goodness, that cat looks so beautiful as the Tyrael Angel with the cloud! I had no idea how epic the cloud actually looked when we're in retro mode. We're in Team Pixel 3, although you can't really tell because retro mode... Oh, looks like somebody's building up there. That is awesome, man. I'm looking so forward to it. There are some epic builds going on here. Wee! This is supposed to be some kind of a ride, so let's see where this is. Ah, whoa, uh, uh, uh. Looks like we took the wrong side. Well, let's take this side then. Where is this actually going to take us? Fanone created this. He has actually been doing some fantastic builds. Doesn't seem like he quite understands how mag rails work, though. Uh, by the way, the beeping in the background was like a dishwasher. Okay, well, anyways, uh, before we end up starting the adventure, too, because we're gonna wander around here a little bit before we continue onward, don't forget to smack that like button, everybody. I would very, very much appreciate it. So many people are asking me about joining the club. Oh my goodness. Neo140. Then there's All Fire Drifter. Uh, then there's also Night Royale. Oh my goodness, I couldn't invite him though, my goodness. Hello everybody! How y'all doing today? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, what I wanted to actually do today, because we haven't actually officially talked about or stopped, because things have just been going crazy. Like, it's been so crazy active that I need to take a little bit of a breather in today's episode just to hang out and show you all what you've given me. So, thanks to everybody who's given me the referral dragon. Now, the way that this works is pretty much when you get, like, you, you have to be under level, or ma under mastery 30, uh, you can refer someone, which I still have it in the description, not that I'm asking for anybody refer to refer me, but if you want to, you always can. Uh, now, what you get for referring is you're gonna end up getting this first dragon, is one of the things which I never like these cardboard cookie cutout dragons. I never like this first form. I do like his head, but I think he would be so much cooler without the wings just as a walking lizard. So that's one of the prizes. Uh, then there is the adult dragon, and this is the one that flies, which he's very, very cool. This dragon very much reminds me of Skyrim, like, uh, even over the other dragons, and you know that they're all about, like, Skyrim in the first place, but this one especially, I don't know what it is about him, he just really reminds me of it. And then, of course, at once, uh, the person that has, like, y you have to get, what is it? Where is a refer a friend? You have to have 30 referrals, which we have 67, so thank you all so much for that. So once you get 30 referrals, you end up getting this bad boy, which is the ultimate one. He can shoot fire as well, which we are not going to do presently, because that would be horrible. What are the other rewards that we actually get for him? Because that's what I wanted to do on camera. So, uh, the first one is the Elder Dragon Ling, which was that first little guy that we ended up showing up. Oh no, never mind. The Elder Dragonling is an ally. Where is he? He is this little guy right here. Uh, now, all these little dragons, they're cutums, but they're useless. C especially compared to most of the other, like, allies that you can get. And if he would ever come over here, we could actually see him. He's right there. Look at these little cutums. Oh, kill me. What? Why would you say that? Uh, then the next one that we end up getting is we get the Elder Dragon Squire. Now, this is straight up like the Dova King Dragonborn helmet, which is so awesome. I love this little guy. It's a Quibsley. That's like a Dragonborn helmet. He's so cool, man. I love him. Uh, the other thing, too, that I know you end up getting is out of... Where is it? Dragon Ascension? No? <laughs> Where, where do you get it? A costume? No. Promo? Yeah, there it is. So we get our own Dragonborn Dark Helmet, which doesn't really look like a Dragonborn Helmet so much as a Dark Evil Wizard or something like that. Uh, what else do we get, or is that everything? That might actually already cover it all. Uh, so then we get the Ally, the Dragon Squire, which is the helmet. Uh, this helmet, well, the little Dragonborn Helmet dude, Quibsley, whatever. Uh, then we get the mount, the Elder Fledgling. 
Oh, I see. Then we get the cardboard cookie cutout dragon, the flying dragon, and finally the mastery dragon that floats around. So that's actually it uh, that we get for the friend referral. So, you know, good luck to everybody for that because in order to actually get something like that, uh, it's pretty crazy. Mastery, not, not costumes. There it is. It's pretty crazy because what you actually need in order to get that maxed out is... 30 people to refer which is absolutely crazy but on top of that you need 30 people that not only refer you but also all of them have to get to mastery rank 30 so it's absolutely crazy now i want to go check this out we haven't actually started doing a official team pixel 3 like uh world tour or anything like that because we've been running into some major issues with griefing and stuff more recently uh which is like maybe last week by the time this video comes out uh just because of the irrelevancy of what i'm talking about uh but anyway we were having some griefing issues i didn't even know that there was spikes like this or is that grass yeah i think it's grass this is cool this is like a platforming area oh no we don't even have that much jump so we can barely do this and there's so many people in the way i can't see but that is awesome. I love it. I love platforming stuff like that, especially on the floating islands. Uh, but anyway, we ran into some problems, so we demoted everybody, and we're slowly, ever so slowly, uh, re-giving and re-promoting people to Architect. But otherwise, we're going to have a lot more of a stricter code on it, just because, unfortunately, this game is horrible for griefers, because there's not much of a way that you can prevent it. This is so cool, man. Who built this? I love it. This is great. What's this sign say? Let's say feel home, boys. Oh, yeah. Okay. Because they're building houses similar to the types that I build in Team Pixel 1. Who did this? Park ships here. Made by the real Mike. Or Make or whatever. Awesome, man. That is absolutely great. That is so cool. And airships is something that I definitely love as far as builds are concerned. Especially one of the things that I really wanted to happen in Team Pixel 1. But I just never had the time to do it. And most of the other people building didn't have the time to do it. Um, was floating islands. Like, because you can pretty much build clouds, like, very, very easily. And I just think that that is so cool. I, I always have. Like, floating islands is just, like, one of my favorite game environments. Especially if it's done properly. Now, I really actually dig this thing right here, too. Because this is some weird, like... It's, it's like art in Trove, <laughs> you know? Like, never thought we'd end up running into something like that, especially in Team Pixel. Uh, Kyle Chu, there you go, and Nian Boy 999 There, I hope I did that right. Did I spell that right? No, I didn't. Nian Boy 999 Bloop! There you go, Buster! So what I try and do, of course, too, is try to add people before we end up... Oh my goodness, look, it's even more art! And these would have taken so long to build, too. Like, that's why it's so crazy. Who did this? Congratulations, you have reached the very top. Blocks and blocks. Uh, but why would you come here anyway? <laughs> Alright. You can only get up there if you have enough jump, though. Who did this mag rail? Because this would have been so tedious. Oh my goodness gracious. Like, seriously? Now, let's see if we got the skills to do this. Ah! Yes, we do! Bowser! Just as I planned. Now, you're gonna need boosters... Just for anyone using Magras, you're gonna need boosters before you end up getting to the higher floors that are going on because otherwise you're gonna run into it and end up getting like screwed over. What is this? Somebody is building something over here. It looks like a gigantic evil dragon face. Oh my goodness. Dark Bomb. Yes, you can join the club, Buster. Here you go. Dark Bomb. What is this? I know this is kind of Scythe Rocks. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, oh, this is so cool. I like it. We've been getting some crazy builds in these clubs lately, like seriously. This is awesome though, man. It'd be cool if you could go inside this dragon too. That'd be very, very neat. Looks like somebody bombed the crap out of that house. That house right there and more. So that's probably got to do with that evil grief that's been hanging around. Hello, secret house that nobody knew about. Is this a biome? Yes, it is. So they're actually safe for this build. I very much like this house. Now, this is awesome. Lakeside houses are another thing that I absolutely love. I know that this is kind of an unofficial. It'd be cool if there was proper staircase back up to the top. Or an elevator. I know that we kind of unofficially did like a world tour, but I just kind of wanted to wander around. Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing? Let's respawn. Blah! 
Respawn right here. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing? Yes. Let's go into the basement and let's have some tea and crumpets or something like that. Because that seems like it would be right at home. T Teddy Barrington. Yes. And George Washington. Sometimes I like to come down here and stare at this painting for inspiration. I am the George Washington. Anyway, we're going to call it here for today's episode, ladies and gentlemen, because I got quite a bit of work that I am backed up on as far as YouTube is concerned. Thank you, Captain Trove. You got a shout out for that comment, buddy. Sin Man Studio Superior Fan Eagly Lee. Uh, Crazy Gaming is also here. Waffle Red Superior Fan, I think I just said. Mewtwo Ian Color Dude and everybody else that is actually hanging around us. Although, I personally find it very hard to see everybody's names. But anyway, thanks so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I really do appreciate it i would also appreciate if you would smack that like button share favorite and subscribe to join team pixel thank you all so much for your support and seriously you're making this all absolutely awesome sign on stay epic everybody Believe in yourself